Power 92. We are number one in the streets. Real Radio, the Bang Brothers in the building. Yours truly, DJ Farris, the Midwest Mix Show DJ of the Year. I'm in here, my boy DJ Nafis. He is on the ones and twos. We putting his ass to work early. <laughs> Paris Taylor got them phony ass ear pods in. The things played out about three years ago. Girl, don't nobody wear them damn things no more. That's like an A-track tape. Just have to get you some new ones. I anyway, got new ones. Mm-hmm, I got a special guest in the building with me tonight. I've been checking out his music now for a minute. My homie, Big Clint, put me up on him, and he's finally arrived. That's right. He came to check us out. New artist, too. We're going to put you down like four flat tires tonight. He goes by the name of... Noxa. Did I say that right? Yes, sir. Okay, Noxa. You I was afraid, it, man. I was afraid of that. And they're like, why do you say it? Noxa, Nixa, Noxa. Yo, Noxa. It's, all, it's all crazy with the spelling, but it looks cool on paper, so that's what matters, right? <laughs> does, it, does, it, does it have a certain meaning? Did it derive from something or what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, it was basically in a point in my life where I was like, I was going through a lot of stuff, so I was looking at it as uh, noxious, which means harmful or poisonous to, poisonous to oneself, so I was like, I took that, but I didn't want to be like, just use a word from the dictionary. That's mm-hmm. like a no-no. I'm not going to be logic. Like, mm-hmm. I'm, I got to put my own spin on it. So it was like, and it's kind of apathetic. It's like, nah, XA. And it's just, I don't know. It's Yeah, I figured. I figured, I I like figured it. it has some uh, deeper meaning to it. Yeah. That's why I was, I couldn't wait to ask you about that, man. Where you from, though? Man, I'm from all over the place. Mainly, I grew up in Lansing, Michigan, though. Whoa. And then I moved... I moved all around Michigan. I lived in uh, Bowling Green, Ohio for a little bit, and then I moved out to Homewood my sophomore year of high school, so I've been in the south suburbs for a few okay. years. So basically a, mid- a Midwest brother. That's yes, sir. It. Yes, sir. How, who inspired you like to get into music, man? To be honest, the, yeah. first, uh, the first rapper I ever heard, my friend showed me, he was like, Bro, you got to listen to this. Stop listening to what you're listening to. It was Dr. Dre. Oh, wow. So that's that's how I got into it. <laughs> yeah. Dr. Dr. Dre, that, that's a throwback yeah. right there. Yes, sir. The Chronic. No. <laughs> <laughs> that's what I started off on. So. No kidding. Really? Yeah. And that shows in a lot of my songs and my style. I try to go through, like, I respect emceeing, the art of mm-hmm. rap. And that's something kids are out of touch with these days. Like, mm-hmm. it's a... It's not a very fine line between R&B and hip-hop now, so I'm, I'm not going to lie. I ride the segue. I, I do different types of music, but my heart lies with hip-hop and, like, the emceeing aspect of it. Like, if you don't got cold wordplay, it's over with. Like, I won't listen to you. Really? <laughs> yeah, so they just can't be singing with the auto-tune. Yeah, no. They got to have some substance they, to it. Huh? Yes, sir. Substance is everything. Oh, yeah, definitely, definitely. Like, who, who uh, besides Dre, was it anybody else that, like, that you looked up to or respected? Definitely. When I started rapping myself, I was looking at Chance the Rapper. Because mm, that was on, 10 Day was on repeat sophomore year every day wow. in between the classes. So there's a lot of, there's a lot of, I tip my hat to him here and there on the project coming up. A relationship, you have some, a relationship with Juice World, you have a friendship. What's yeah, up with that? Yeah, definitely. Uh, it's crazy how we met though. I didn't, I didn't meet him rapping. I met him at the skate park. Mm. I, I taught him how to ride a mini ramp. <laughs> and then he was uh he was freestyling with with a group of people and I was like, yo, I should freestyle with him. Like I didn't think he was good, bro. <laughs> I was like, I was like, yo, who's this kid rapping at the skate park? <laughs> and no that, was, that was before though. And uh I didn't I didn't end up going freestyling over with him. I wish I would have though, but yeah. my friend's like, bro, do you know who that is? I was like, yeah, I taught him how to Skate a mini ramp. <laughs> but that's how you hear right now. You yes, arrived at Showtime, no doubt. So so you were on the Tony Hawk stuff. like Man, like, a little bit. I yeah. used to be a lot colder in high school, but I kind of dedicate all my time to music now, you know. Mm-hmm. Were you, gotta grind. Were you like deep into the X Games and stuff like that? Heck no. Nah. Nah, what? I just, <laughs> Dude, that's what the X Games I just like to ride it. Dude, I just like to ride it. That's it. It's the feeling. Uh-huh. I, it's the feeling. I don't like to watch. Mm-hmm. I like to do like to do it? Yes, sir. You ever broke any limbs messing around man. on that thing, man? Just a couple of fingers and toes. Ooh. Nothing serious. See, now I've you been gotta, blessed. Yeah, you, you definitely got it <laughs> hard to deal with that, man. Are you currently, like, signed to any label? Nah, no label deals right now. I just got the best management right now. And who That's is that? I, need. I got Silent Partner, Blackie. I got Clint, Clint the Jeweler. Yes, sir. Yup. Always iced out. Yes, sir. That's my buddy. Both uh-huh. of them right there, my people. You definitely yes, are in good hands. Believe <laughs> that. I, I heard a few songs already. Uh, do you have an album? You working on an album right now? Yeah, it's a it's a dope project. Honestly, I put 
all my energy into it for the last few months, sleepless nights. Mm-hmm. Like, my boy hates me because uh, I never hang out with the guys. He's like, bro, you need to take a break. You need to come out and hang out with us. I'm like, nah, dude, it's music now. It's music. <laughs> when he get rich, then you can hang out. Oh, it'll take you everywhere around the world then, bro. Yeah. Then you really get to kick it for real, for real. <laughs> uh, um, Is there anybody in particular right now that you would like to have like a, as a feature or something on your on your project? As a feature? Yeah, there's somebody you want to work with. Endless list of people I would want to feature with, but... Give me your bucket list, like your top three. We got, obviously, Chance the Rapper, because that's who I grew up. And, man, I got a perfect song for him on the project. I got a song he would eat up, but... Yeah, That's, that's okay. out of reach right now, I don't okay. know. But okay, we're going. We got that, and then me and Juice were going to make a song before he blew up. So, yeah. Juice, where's that feature? Oh, I need 200, got- 300,000 <laughs> now for I a know. verse. Yeah. And then that, and then definitely Wayne. I need Lil Wayne. Whoa. Yeah. You know what I hear? A lot of cats, a lot of new cats still, like, really reach for Wayne. I guess Wayne, Wayne must have really made an impact on y'all lives with his lyrical content. You got huh? the parts. Like I said, I started off with Dr. Dre. You got to be MC, and Wayne, was he's top yeah. of the food chain. Wayne yeah. was definitely. <laughs> if you want bars, Wayne yes, is the way to go. Yes, indeedy. So you got that project you're working on, so... We're going to wait for the whole thing. When you put the whole thing together, you know you got to come back here. And we just yes, going to blast off, you know what I'm saying, record for record and just go crazy in the joint. Mm-hmm. You, you, hey, your music is cold. I'm, your man's let me check something out. <laughs> I was an instant fan. Like, yo, yo, how can I get him on my project? So I know, man, it's about to blow. You got a single right now. Tell us a little bit about your new single. Yes, sir. I got a single produced by Enzo. It's called I Love You. It's dope. Yeah? Well, let's introduce it to the people of Chicago yes, right sir. now. Yes, sir. Let's go. Tell me your name. This is Noxa. You're about to listen to I Love You. You heard it first right here on Power 92. The big record breakers are in the building, Noxa. Let's go. Real lyricism is not dead. <laughs> it's not dead, man. I got you. It's not dead you, at all. Man, and coming from Chicago, man. Tell you the truth, when hip hop really started like elevating in Chicago, it was real lyricists. Backpack rap, we used to call them. Cats with real lyrics, substance, records, stuff like that. You know, it wasn't drill first. You know, we just got a little notoriety because of yes, social sir. media, et cetera, et cetera, mm-hmm. made us and labeled us the drill town. No. That stuff you spitting, man, that's that's where it all started, man. Right here man. in Chi you dig? I, I love it, man. I love the the, the Chicago scene is really the best place to grow as an artist because there's so much diversity. And from mm-hmm. an external standpoint, you might not see all that. Mm-hmm. You might just see what the cameras point at. But if you're about and you network, you know there's so much more to Chicago than drill music. There's yes. so much more to Chicago. Yeah. Yes, it is. Everybody's got their lane, man. And I'm happy that, you know, you have arrived. A breath of, breath of fresh air, bro. Oh, for yeah. real. For Appreciate real. it. Tell them again the name of the single. Where can they get it at? Man, it's... I love you, and uh, it's gonna be released on all platforms. Uh, probably early June is when the album's dropping. Early June, you gonna yes, drop sir. the whole thing, huh? Yes, sir. Y'all got a name for it yet? Dark Night of the Soul. Dark Night of the Soul. This dude yes, is sir. deep, man. <laughs> this dude is deep right here. That's actually uh, it's something that uh, mystics go through in religion. If you follow religion, mystics go through a dark night of the soul. Is basically where you feel out of touch with a higher being or higher higher power. And my name, Noxa, being how I was feeling, like, harmful to myself, I was out of touch with a higher power. And there's it'll all tie in together. You'll see. There's, like, a climax at the end of it that the outro is really going to tie it together. This is so. something that you study. Where would you get this knowledge from? Man, you just, you just live your life and do your research. I mean, if it relates to you, it relates to you, so... Very intelligent young man. Yes, you are, man. I see a bright future ahead of you, and we got an open door for you anytime you're ready to come through and you got some new material, please. And I got to get you on my project. Yes, Clint. sir. Point blank, period. <laughs> We're going to make sure we blow you up. Let everybody know your social media handle so they can follow you. Man, if they're not. at Noxa IRL. That's my Instagram. It's N A H X A I R L. All right, cool, cool. Go follow him. Don't sleep. Don't jump Don't on sleep. a damn bandwagon. <laughs> After the fact, man, we put you on True. early. We educate you early. Don't be left out. Go follow my people right now. Support him. Support his project. It is definitely dropping soon in June. That's right around the corner, man. Before we know it, you will be here. All right? 
We looking for that. Power 92, number one in the streets. Reminder, you can also listen to us at home from Alexa. Simply say, Alexa, play WPWX Power 92, and we bump it in your crib. Noxa, we appreciate you coming back appreciate and see you. us when the album drops. Clint, you already know we family. That's it, man. DJ Nathan's on the ones and twos, 773-375-9248. If you got a request, we are all requests till 2 o'clock in the morning. If you're looking to party tonight, it goes down at Red Diamond. Everybody free all night long. Tonight at Red Diamond Plus, 147 Cowboys having his platinum party. Hope we be giving you one of them soon. <laughs> 147 Cowboy Platinum Party is having their structure tonight. You can check that out, too. All right, Chi-Town, put the guns down, turn up the music, and rock with power. Power 92, 92.3 FM.